Well, Rob, this is it. Mm. This is the last event in the UAE for now. It's been a pleasure. It's definitely been a pleasure. Thanks to Steve and Lolly Gibbs mm -hmm. for putting us up. Yes, they've been uh, more than accommodating. Yep, definitely. Um, so we've got the Women's World Championship 10-pin bowling. Yeah. How's your bowling form? Oh, man, I'm, I'm pretty good. Top score? 2-2-7, two, two, ah, I think. Damn, that's yeah. better than 1-9-2. Yeah. Nine, nine, yeah, yeah, no, I've hit 200 a couple of times. Not far off, but she's got 205 then. Yeah, so. yeah, I'll give her a good run for money. The US girl, so yeah. yeah. Oh, well, let's go bowling. Five days of sport we're at the Women's World Tempted Bombing Championship with Mai and Britt from Denmark. Girls, bit of a tough loss in the semi final there, a bit unfortunate. Yeah, yeah, it didn't, it didn't go our way. It was definitely a difficult pair, and we were struggling a little bit. And we had a game plan, and we actually followed it pretty well. But um, the lanes changed so fast during the yeah. game, and then we weren't fast, I wasn't fast enough to, to make the right moves. I saw the coach giving you a few tips halfway through as well. Was, yeah. he, was it a really a case of changing everything as, as you went? No, not really. It's just like small changes. Yeah. And then we, we had some couple of bad breaks, and I had some lucky ones, and then I loosen up, and yeah. she might be tightened up. And then it's difficult whenever the lane conditions are yeah, a bit yeah. difficult and not our way. So. It's always tough, these one game, one game semi finals. There's a lot on the line just in one game. Yeah, yeah it's just one goal. You mean, I mean, look, I mean, a break for them and a bad break for us. Yeah. And, and, yeah. Thanks, girls. Commiserations on the semi final loss, but best of luck. You know, in the European Championships, and uh, keep going strong. Thanks. Thank you. Championships. Kelly, you must be ecstatic. What a result. Yeah, uh, gold medal and doubles for me on the short pattern. This is truly an exciting day for me, for us as a team. Koreans sort of put a fair bit of uh, pressure on you throughout. Um, Danielle Roy taking the reins initial first part of the match and then you came through and closed it out nicely. Yeah, she by her striking out the 10th frame really gave us a chance to win it. Yeah. And the Koreans never miss. They literally never miss yeah. and she's so strong on the, on the short. on the Skype back to mum and dad now and let them know the news? Absolutely, yeah. I go home, you know, we're nine hours ahead here from the States. I'm going to go call her up and tell her that we let it and then we finish strong and win gold. 
Well, Kelly, if you need to celebrate tonight, it's a bit hard to come by these things, but we know where to go if you need to go to bars and, and, and you, celebrate properly. Um, so, you know, we've got the inside word there if you need any help. Please save it for Sunday, maybe after the banquet. We'd love to, to celebrate with some, you know, <laughs> adult beverages, but uh, right now we're going to focus on tomorrow's event. Very professional. Good, good answer. Thank keep you. it, Keep the coach that we have with that. Congratulations. Thank Enjoy you. tonight. And uh, we'll do. All the best for the rest. Thank you very much. Days ago, yep. we've seen some unbelievable stuff, but that was probably one of the tensest uh, things we've seen. Very close final. Yeah. I thought the, I was hoping the Koreans would win. Yeah. For the sake of uh, for their country, for their people, to overcome. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> no, 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 I just thought I'd like to see them win because the US. You'd assume the US would win bowling. Yeah, true. Pretty much. Yep. Um, but then you know I wanted a good interview afterwards, so. Uh, yeah. Speaking English would be preferable as to not yeah, being able yeah. to speak English. Oh, yeah. for us, definitely. Yeah, otherwise I'd end up doing some sort of dance routine or something. Um, oh, yeah. Still, that could have worked well too, and who knows? Yeah. Guess we'll never know. Definitely. Yeah, no, it was pretty tense, and it mm. flip flopped from, uh, from team to team, and uh, in the end, if the Korean girl hadn't bowled a nine with the first ball of the tenth frame, it might have uh, might have been like literally a pin or two between them. Yeah, I think it was about three or four pins. Yeah. In between. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. So, um, chance of death rating in Tempe bowling. Sweeps. Sweeps in Seattle zero. And yeah. um, I'm not going to give a beard rating. I'm going to give a ponytail rating. Okay. So there we were didn't, didn't take in the sexist element of the beard rating, no, did you? Not it really, really, really no, cuts out the population. The, the women's world. Yeah. Yeah. No. Okay. So the ponytail rating. Yeah. Um, I haven't really thought this through either because I don't know the rankings of Ponytail, but it was quite my little pony. Well, um, well that's really a wrap on uh, Abu Dhabi, Dubai, the UAE, isn't it? Yeah, we've done 23 sports in 20 days. Mm. It's quite unbelievable because we've missed a few as well. It's time for a beer. Oh, it is for you. Mm. More than <laughs> one. Good, luck. Yeah. Good luck with the driving. Yeah. Thank you, the UAE, it's been fun. But now Scandinavia awaits. Until next time.